Phoenix take it on the right side. Richie now goes to the top for Eichler. Great move underneath. Lydia Bauer puts it in with the left hand. Four to nothing, Phoenix. Now Varner was just trying to front Bauer there, and she's going to half. It's all Green Bay so far. Adrian Richie trying to add some more. No. Three-pointer miss. Whitey gets the offensive board and puts it in. 6-0 Green Bay. A couple of Crusaders. It looked like it was Phoenix. They get it inside. Bauer trying to kick it out to Lucan. Now Richie launches a three from the right side. Adrian Richie, silky smooth, able to drop in a three-pointer to miss Green Bay team. It's been so difficult to defeat them in general. That's especially because Green Bay so talented through all five. Valpo needs to be. And Ashley Varner now trying to step up for Valpo. She has scored all four of the Crusaders' points to make the shot a little bit more difficult. And then a really good box out to keep White from getting the rebound. Timmerman with a nice drive in, and Timmerman able to score. It's a one-possession game, and Green Bay will take a timeout. In real good presence of mind and able to find Gina Lang open on the baseline. 11 minutes ago, Green Bay increases the lead. Julia White yet again, 16 to 8 the score. Now she just got lost there underneath and was. Hannah Quilling with the ball for the Phoenix. Kicks it out to Lee Bauer. Deep three point shot, nothing but net. A huge dagger from deep. Puts Green Bay. Good steps inside, drawing off Richards. Now the pass goes inside to Hannah Quilling, who banks it in with the left hand. 25 to eight in favor of the Phoenix. Crusaders trying to get something offensively. Bass just gets into Lang. Nice reverse off the feed from Jan Sone. Valpo trying to strike back. That's their first bucket in five minutes. Bauer flipping one inside. Wida knocks it out to Quilling, who buries a three-pointer. What an amazing play for Green Bay. Yeah, that's a group for the Crusaders in this half. Richard steals a pass intended for Wida, flips it over towards Jansone. Jansone driving in, banks one in. That snaps a scoring scoreless. Green Bay up 21, skip pass, and a three-point attempt up. And no good for Eichler. Ball tipped to Richie. Spin around move on the block. And she nails a shot. Keith Freeman livid on the Valpo bench. Wide and left wide open. Launches a three in and out. Offensive rebound again for the Phoenix. This time it's Megan Lucan with the putback. Stay up. And a really good defense there by Gina Lang to contest without fouling and force Wider to miss the basket. Tabitha Gerardo with a quick make. The first points of the half make it 41 to 19. We're back to action. Here in Valparaiso, screen and slip for Gina Lang. Left-handed layup good, and the foul. Gina Lang with another fantastic day, her second this week in double figures. Lang covered this time around. Green Bay learning from its earlier mistakes. Bounce pass, Lang just gets it. Goes up for the shot, good. And another foul on Gina Lang, and another three-point play chance. And again, Gina Lang continues. She played really well against Milwaukee on Thursday night. These starters that have played a lot of minutes are keeping up the intensity. Carr, a jump shot, good. Jessica Carr was bageled against Milwaukee on Thursday. Ranger just beyond the block, skips it over to Lucan. Lucan drives in, got past Richards, and she puts one in. 65-35, and another shot coming up from the free throw line. As clock, three to go. Richards brings it up off a screen from Lang. Steps in, no shot will be put up. Valpo held under 40 for the third time this year. 65 to 37 is the score as the number nine Green Bay Phoenix go to 19 and 0, continuing the best start in Green Bay and Horizon League women's basketball history. And really.